And this is a video tutorial for the Lansdale Borough curb ramp inspection and inventory update. What we're going to do is open up our ArcGIS Field Maps app, either use Field Maps or Collector. We're going to go to the curb ramp update. This will auto locate you to wherever you are in town. If you click on the nearby curb ramp, a pop-up appears with a couple options of the current grade. You can edit, inspect curb ramp. First, we're gonna edit the basic inventory by clicking that edit button. We're gonna choose the date for the field date that it was updated. Update its letter grade according to our ranking system. This one was recently upgraded from a C to an A. A just a beautiful curb ramp here with two, two pads on either side at the corner of Columbia and Salford. We're gonna update it with a nice looking picture. Hit use photo in the bottom right corner. And that's gonna be just about it for the actual inventory. We'll hit submit in the top right. The updates are sent and the inventory is up to date. Now, separate from the inventory is the inspection process. There's a button like the original pop-up that we just saw called inspect. We're gonna click that and then go through, hit inspect curb ramp. This will bring us to a series of fields, all drop-down menus. We're gonna choose the inspection date, the inspector, the type of curb ramp. There's lots of choices here and to assist with that decision-making process, any curb ramp inspector should have access to this handy document of the different types of curb ramps. We can make this available on the iPad or whatever mobile device you prefer to use. Once the type of curb ramp is identified, we're going to choose that here from the drop down list and then continue with the inspection process. We're going to select a type of ramp. I will, of course, need a smart level to measure the slopes of the ADA curb ramps and their relationship to compliancy. Check the slopes of the approach landing ramps. If the wing slope is accept acceptable, mark if there's any concrete issues. If there is a DWS pad present, how many there are. And then a simple yes or no for whether this ramp is ADA compliant. We'll always have a comment section for any additional information. You can type or speak into it. This ramp is good to go, just a little dirty. And then we just hit simply hit submit and that curb ramp has been inspected and the inventory has been updated. Two separate processes though.